Well, uh, today we're going to see a couple of uh, clips, runs number three and four, uh, which were fairly short. And the camera was mounted on the frame underneath the engine facing towards the rear. And I, uh, it's a Hero 3 and installed it in its waterproof case, which helped muffle some of the loud sounds. And it gave me, unexpectedly, uh, it gave me a perspective, a sound I could hear was more vibration transmitted through the framework, I guess, to the camera. And you get to hear gears and uh, the engine shaft, more vibrations like that. So um, it's kind of a neat perspective. You When you can hear it, the fuel pump come on and then you'll hear the starter obviously wind the engine up. And when it lights off, you can really hear that RPM start increasing and it comes up to idle. Uh, and then, um, of course, you get a view of some of the fire from the jet pipe as it, you know, lights off and accelerates up to idle. And, and when we spool it, shut the fuel off and kill the engine, you get to hear it spool down. That's a neat, neat sound. So, uh, hope you enjoy it. And thanks for watching.
Okay, there's runs number three and four. Um, it ran out of fuel there uh, at the end of four. And as it started slowing down and I heard that, I knew the tank was low. I hit the uh, fuel cutoff valve switch, which you know shut it on down. Uh, and that was my crazy cousin uh, taking pictures um, of the rear end of the engine as it ran. And uh, he was advised of the you know danger back there. Uh, but as you can see, he was able to withstand the wind there at idle, and he was probably, I don't know, you know, maybe 20 feet away from the engine. Um, but nevertheless, not a safe place to be, you know, if something were to go to pieces here and come out the back end. But hey, it worked out for the best. It was fun. So, thanks for watching.